undo the 12 mil bolt And while the oil is draining, undo this plate here, which has this small gearbox oil filter behind it. So here's the bike, and it's these two 8mm bolts. Someone's got a 1980s car alarm still fitted. Ooh. Okay, so that's sprung. There's a spring on there pushing against it. Okay, so here's the oil, oil filter housing. There's an O ring around there. There's a spring in the middle, a short spring. Both ends appear to be the same. And then there's the actual paper filter there. It's quite inset, it's quite recessed. So I can't get it to get it out. Let me see what tools I can use. Okay, I've just been and picked up some circuit pliers out of the garage. And I'm gonna see if I can use these. Yeah, that works quite nicely. So just pushing them in the center of the, it's like a little uh, detent area so then you can pull out the filter there's a rubber seal at the lower end which is integral to the filter so the new filter has the new filter has that rubber seal already on it and it actually says outside pointing this way so here's my new filter There's a little section like a tube that it just fits over the that fits inside that rubber seal. So it just it holds itself in position. And then I'm gonna have my spring. And then I'm gonna have my plate. You can replace the rubber o-ring. I'll put the part numbers in the description or take a picture. And the line goes uppermost. The sharp line is up. And the middle of the spring is going to sit in the middle of this casting. Yeah, so I can feel that's correct. I've got it in the middle of the casting, and then I'm going to push it into position as I do the bolts up. Okay, so all I did is just held it flat against the machined face of the engine and did up those two 8mm bolts equally while pushing against it the whole time and then I can use a torque wrench on them in a minute just to nip them up